My name is Chris Sanders and I collect, study, and sell rocks from space. I want to show you a cool feature we sometimes find inside these meteorites. Have you ever seen a rock that looks like a mashup of broken puzzle pieces all smashed together? That's called a brescia, and although it happens to rocks here on Earth, it's also a term we use to describe some meteorite features too. Now brecciation isn't just a meteorite thing, it's a geological term used for all kinds of rocks. These rocks on screen now are actually some terrestrial examples of brescias. Brecciation happens when a rock is broken into angular fragments called clasts that are later cemented or compacted back together by finer material, mineral growth, or molten phases, often due to tectonic, volcanic, sedimentary, or impact-related forces. Now, it's those impact-related forces we're mostly talking about when we are describing meteorite features. That often means an asteroid got body slammed by another object. It's an impact so intense it fractured the rock, mixed in other bits, and sometimes fused it all together through heat or pressure. The result is a brecciated meteorite, a chaotic patchwork of older rock fragments and melted or compressed matrix. Interestingly enough, some brushes even mix material from different types of rock or from multiple impact events. For example, the meteorite on screen now is a mesosiderite and it has fragments from two different asteroids, one primarily metal, the other primarily silicates, and now they're together. The result is pretty beautiful, particularly when sliced and polished like these. Here's a lunar brescia, NWA 15605. It contains fragments of the moon and likely the impacting asteroid that broke it away. This one is a howardite from asteroid Vesta that has class of other Vestian rocks like Eucrites or Diagonites within it. And finally, this one is really special. It's NWA 7475, a Martian rock known as Black Beauty. It's one of the only Martian brushes we've discovered so far. As you might imagine, brushes can make the analysis of some rocks more complex because in truth, you're actually dealing with multiple rocks in a single stone that you have to analyze and assess. While brushes can look like a cluttered mess, they tell a really complex story that involves at least a couple of different characters and their individual geologic process. Really neat. Want to see more space rocks like these? Make sure to give me a follow.